And we're coming at you live, coast to coast, with the most incredible game, the most incredible environment you've ever seen. And it's created for one purpose and one purpose only, and that's for you folks at home to play our game. Let's go meet that person right now. Let's see who it is. Up there on the satellite, coming at us live and in color, it's Lenny in Ohio. Hiya, Lenny. Hi, Hi how you doing, Peter? Good. How are you? Lenny. What do you do there? I'm a writer, a uh, copywriter, and also an illustrator. And I have, have something to show you here, Peter. Right. It's a uh, cartoon I drew. I stayed up all night doing this. Now, that gives you an idea of what I look like before Jody puts my makeup on before the show. <laughs> that's just great. Well, that's great. Thank you, Lenny. And folks on the internet and the phone and the satellite people, including Lenny, here's the question. What did famous Amos do for a living before he started baking cookies? A, basketball player. B, teacher. C, theatrical agent. Or D, opera singer. I do not know the answer to this question. Uh... I'm going to guess. say that he was a teacher. You say he was a teacher, B. No, the correct answer is C, the actual agent. That cost you $1,000. We can still go after Lenny, or we can go to the next question, which would be question six. Uh, let's go on to the next question. Go on to the next, next question. You don't want to go after Lenny on this. No. Should we go after it? Should we find out what Lenny did? Yeah. yeah, let's find out. Lenny, what would you have said? Well, I knew that Famous Amos was a theatrical agent. Wow. Well done. I think that was a tough one. Let's go to see a selected folks on the internet and the phone, and let's just see how they did with that question, because I think it was a tough one. Let's see if I'm right. Wow, look at that. Uh, internet, no one got that right. Let's, uh, let's jump over on the phone and see if anybody got it. Wow. Nobody, at least of the five we selected. Uh, so that's, uh, it is a tough question. All for one and one for all was the motto of Athos, Porthos, and which third musketeer? A, Duma. B, D'Artagnan, C, Aramis, or D, Gaspar? It must have smelled really good, because I think it's Aramis. Aramis, very good, and you did a joke in there, too, and you're right. <laughs> Getting confident. Okay, we're down to Lenny. Um, 5,000 Lenny, question seven, or you can go after him. Peter, I'm not gonna fool around. I wanna knock you him out. You can knock Lenny out. All right, give me this back. Give me $3,000. Lenny. You know something? No one goes away empty-handed here, even though he knocked you out. You're going to have $500, so I appreciate your playing. We'll put you back in the pool so you can get selected again. And thanks for being with us, OK? Great. Take and care, Lenny. All right, thanks say goodbye to your family. Nice going, Steve. You did it.